The biocontainment unit is a special unit that's been designed to take care of patients who might have high consequence pathogens. It's a special unit that has the capabilities to contain an infectious disease both from an operation standpoint with the special air handling system or special layout for the unit, but also has trained staff that is skilled in infection prevention protocols and specific procedures to contain a pathogen. This unit itself is not required to take care of patients with coronavirus, but it's just one of many spaces in the hospital that has that negative pressure uh, airflow that allows us to safely isolate a patient to keep our healthcare workers safe, to keep patients and their families safe. We're coming up with a plan here at Hopkins to be able to provide the capacity to test for patients who present to our hospital, not just through the emergency department or who are already in the health system, but potentially uh, through outpatient testing sites, likely PCR-based tests, um, which you know, allows you to get an answer as to whether or not you're, you're finding evidence of the virus in someone's respiratory secretions within a few hours. I expect we're going to start seeing positive cases who are going to require hospitalization. What we don't know yet is we don't know how many we're going to see and we don't know how many of those patients are, are going to require critical care.